Hi, I'm Russ from David French Music. I'm one of the string technicians here. I'm gonna go over how to put on your shoulder rest, whether it's a foam one or if it's one of these plastic ones. So, after you rosined up your bow and you tightened it, you'll pull your instrument out and uh, you have a couple options here. Now, your teacher may have uh, a different way of doing this, but uh, check in with them to see if they have a specific way they'd like them. I'm gonna show you how uh, you could do it if uh, your teacher is unavailable. So, if you have two rubber bands here, you're gonna start with one. You're gonna put it over one wing like this. I start with, sorry, I start with the base side over here, which is the lower, and you're gonna string it uh, all the way to the button of the violin. I'm just gonna loop it around just like that. Then you'll take the other side here, the other rubber band, and go on the other side, the treble side, and string it over your chin rest just like this and right to that button again right and it should be nice and snug that rubber band shouldn't be going anywhere then you'll take your shoulder rest now uh, these foam ones here what you want to make sure there's usually a thicker side and a thinner side as you can see the thicker and thinner here what you're going to do is you're going to take the thicker side and put it on the bottom the opposite of your chin rest. So all you have to do is just pull out the rubber bands and pop that right there and then scooch it up close to the, the bottom of the violin and you're ready to play. Now if your violin came in with pre-tied rubber bands that looks like three rubber bands all tied together, this is how you're going to put it on. You're going to take that center rubber band and hook it right at the end at the button, right? Then you're going to take one of the wings and hook it onto one side here, just on the bottom. Then you're going to take the other one and do the same thing on the other side. After doing that, You'll take your shoulder rest. You'll see there's a thicker side or a thinner side again. The thicker side is going to go on the opposite side of the chin rest. So here's the chin rest here. You just sneak that underneath the rubber bands, just like that. Scooching it up as close to the bottom of the violin. And then you're ready to go. If you find that your rubber bands are not holding well, you could even put it all the way to the top of the wings just like that. Now, if your violin came with one of these plastic foam, uh, foam shoulder rests, this is how you'll place it onto your violin. Now, you'll notice that there's a curve to your shoulder rest. There's a higher side and a lower side. You gotta make sure that lower side is right underneath the shoulder rest, uh, the chin rest, excuse me. So, you'll just place the grips on the edges of the violin, and just scooch them all the way until they are tight on the body. Now, you want to make sure that it stays below the wings here. It's about almost halfway up to these bottom wings of the violin here. And then you're ready to play.